what's up guys welcome back to my channel so as you guys can see i tried decorating my background to try to make it look more aesthetically pleasing you know more youtube-ish but i failed so you know when you plan something out in your head and in your head it looks super super cute like really nice well that's what happened here i had this whole thing planned in my head like how i wanted the fixtures the decorations the lights everything and i thought it was gonna look so bomb for my background and now that i spent all this money ordered everything online had it shipped waited i was so excited to unwrap everything and put everything up and finally when i set everything together well this is what i got <laughs> Guys, this is horrible! <laughs> Guys, this background is so ass. I'm sorry, but it looks so tacky and I'm so sad because I was really anticipating this whole background thing and it did not come out as planned. I need to figure something out. Hopefully there's a way where I can like fix it and make it look cuter. <laughs> But you know, I, I guess I tried. Anyways, so today's gonna be a very special video. As you guys may know, it's October. October is by far one of my most favorite months because it's spooky season. The leaves are falling. The leaves are changing colors. Halloween's coming up. Pumpkin spice, everything. Hello, hello. When I say pumpkin, you say spice. Pumpkin spice, pumpkin spice. Woo! I am feeling spooky, yes! I love spooky season. I am a spooky bitch. So anyways, other than the fact that it's October, it is also Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So you're probably gonna see a lot of pink everywhere you go. Pink ribbons, pink shoes, pink outfits, pink everything. Pink is the color for breast cancer. Duh. So I thought it'd be an awesome idea to make a special tribute to Breast Cancer Awareness Month. So today, we are gonna be doing a pink look. That means we are gonna get dolled up from head to toe, all in pink, boo-boo. We are gonna be pinked out. Can I get a P-I-N-K? Pink is such an awesome color, I love pink. Like, who doesn't love pink? So I'm really excited to do this look. Let's jump to it. If you guys haven't seen my Jeffree Star video where I transformed myself into Jeffree Star, well, I had this light baby pink wig on. So I'm gonna use that same wig, but I wanted to change it up a bit. So I went to Target and I bought that pink hair dye spray to make it like a darker pink. And guys, as I was preparing my wig, things got a little crazy. Like this hair dye got everywhere, all over my shirt, all over my face. And I didn't even notice until my mom pointed it out. She was like, why is your whole body pink? I'm like, what do you mean? Like, oh my God, Patrick! <laughs> it's Patrick Star. Thank you very much. Hi Patrick, how are ya? So anyways, as I was preparing the wig, I got pink all over me, so Right now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wipe my face with a makeup wipe and get my face ready for this beat, girlfriend. So guys, not only did I go buck wild crazy over this weekend, spending all kinds of money on my decorations, on my lights, on everything, I also invested a lot of money in some makeup and a lot of other goodies. So I ordered some stuff from, by the way guys, please, please, whatever you do, don't order anything from Amazon. Especially if you have Prime, that shit is dangerous, okay? I think I went bankrupt this weekend. It is so addicting and I think I have a, I think I have a problem. Hi, you have a problem. 
Okay guys, yeah, no, seriously, I went nuts over the weekend and I ordered a lot of stuff. Not only did I order from Amazon, I did order a few things from Ulta. I love Ulta, love, love it. Okay, Ulta is the superior, the baddest makeup store you can, you can have. Like, I'm sorry, Sephora, you're cute and all, but you just don't compare. Well, what does Sephora give you? Like one little tiny ounce of a lipstick for your birthday? Like, girl, that's once a year. I'm gonna need you to do a little better than that, honey. You spend like $500 there and you get like two and a half points. Like, no. No, bitch. <laughs> Only in America. Then I put it in a bun. Where was I? Oh yeah, I'm sorry, Sephora, but you need to step it up, honey, because those little birthday gifts that you get once a year for your birthday, that girl, that's once a year. Like I need savings all year long. Ulta on the other hand, Ulta is the queen, the iconic, the baddest. We love her. Ulta be having sales all day, every day. So anyways, over the weekend, Ulta obviously had all kinds of sales and with certain purchases, they gave you free gifts. So one of the gifts that I got was this little packet right here. So it's just a little clear bag. You could put whatever you want in here. But in this bag came eight different foundations. So I'm gonna show you guys a few of the stuff that I got. So they gave me this little cutie right here. It is Pericone MD. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Anyways, look at how cute she is. It's one of those like, those little drip ones, you know? And then we got the iconic face tape. Also included in the bag was this It CC Plus full coverage. And guys, can you believe they even gave me an airbrush foundation brush. How cute. And then we got a few samples from NARS, Urban Decay, Lancome. Like Ulta did not come to play, boo boo. And also included in the bag were these cute little makeup wipes. On the go cleansing, vitamin E. So Ulta gave me all these cute little things for free. Like, I swear, Alta's like that boyfriend that you wish you always had, the one that you always see in the movies and stuff that always buys their girlfriend flowers and chocolates and everything. Like, Alta is like that boyfriend that just gives you little gifts for free, like little cute surprises. I love it. Ooh, and this brush is so smooth. Can't wait to try it. Oh, it's an it brush. Okay, okay, it, I see you, boo boo. Okay guys, so since I have like, well, you can't really see it right now, but I had like pink on my face. I think you could still see it kind of. Anyways, so I'm gonna go ahead and use these free little makeup wipe removers that Alta gave me just to wipe off whatever pink residue I have on me. I never use makeup wipes. I always just wash my face whenever I wanna take my makeup off, but I really love the feeling of makeup wipes, or at least this one. My face feels so like hydrated and refreshed. You guys see that little pink stuff right there? That's evidence. Okay, so I wiped my face off pretty good. We're gonna move on to the next step. Okay, mmm. I don't know why my face feels like it's burning now. Ulta, what did you put in here, boo boo? Pro vitamin B5, vitamin E. It must be the vitamins doing its work, replenishing my face. Yeah, I don't know why, but my face is kind of burning. I guess I have sensitive skin. Okay, so I'm gonna take some Mario Badescu. <laughs> Just prep my face a little more, give it some more oomphity oomph. Oomphity oomph. Wow, that was sad. You know when you want to burp and you think you're gonna burp and when you try to burp, you don't burp? That's exactly what happened. And I, oh, so now I got my face pretty prepped up. You know, mm-hmm. Yeah, so I was gonna put some moisturizer on, but it's all the way downstairs and 
do I really want to do all that right now? I don't think I need all that negativity in my life. So we're just going to stay up here and continue on. Because you know how the makeup gurus be like, you know, putting all that extra fancy stuff. You don't even know what it is. Like they put like 10 different things on their face before they even get started with the makeup. And you're just like over here trying to take notes, trying to like keep up. Like, girl, what are you doing? So we're just gonna skip all that and jump right to it. So yeah, I'm gonna just start with my foundation. Since we have all these new samples, I don't know which one I wanna go with. I don't know why, but this one's really calling me. So we're gonna use this one. Okay. Oh. All right, so I guess I'm gonna just... Oh. Well, all right then. Okay, I think I might have overdid it. But, um, oh, before this starts dripping, oh my god, oh my god. I have to, like, pick up my face and hurry up and get my, okay. I'm gonna go ahead with my Morphe brush, M M439, and just, you know, work that magic. Okay. Oh. It smells like alcohol. Ooh, okay. My face looks really smooth. Okay, so far, I really like this foundation. I look photoshopped. Girl, do you see any imperfections? Cause I know I don't. So that one's pretty good. What goes next? Okay, I guess we can do concealer next. So I'm gonna go with my go-to concealer. It's the Revlon Photo Ready. And I am like out. So I'm like literally scraping this on my face. Ah, oh, I didn't use this new brush. I forgot I had this. Oh well, next time. Okay, now I feel like I got my face pretty prepped up. Foundation on. Concealer applied. Next step, eyeshadow. Wait, do I want to do my bras first? Okay, scratch that. I'm gonna do my bras first. So with my eyebrow pencil, I'm gonna just shape out my eyebrow and color it in a little bit because what I want to do, well, it's a secret, you'll see. So I'm gonna do my bras. I'll be back. And uh, ooh, hi bras, how are ya? Honey, I like my bras how I like my oatmeal. Thick. But we're gonna add one more extra step. So I never colored my eyebrows with eyeshadow or anything. So this is my first time trying to color my eyebrows with a different color. So I'm gonna go ahead with the Jeffree palette. Hi, how are ya? And I'm gonna go ahead and start off with this bubble gum right here. Hopefully this works. I've never tried it before. Let's see what happens. Okay, it's kind of working. Just got to keep adding some more. The only thing that kind of sucks is that my eyebrows are super dark. This is going to be quite challenging. Okay, okay, she's showing up. Okay, it worked. <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right, let's move on to the next bra. That is so fetch. You know when the haters tell you, stop trying to make fetch happen? Well, honey, it is happening. This is fetch. This is fetch AF. Guys, look at these bras though. Oh my God, they're so pink. Yes. Pink bras are on. Okay, I cleaned up my bras a little more to make them look more, you know, sharp. Bras on fleek. Okay, moving on. So I'm gonna go ahead with this NYX white eyeshadow base. Oh, okay, so this is brand new and there's like a clear plastic thing over it and I did not see it. I just went right in and I'm like, why isn't this touching? Ooh, she's white. 
So guys, there's a new bitch in town. Say hello to the James Charles palette. So I got this over the weekend. Isn't she gorgeous? Oh, darling. I feel like a freaking Picasso. Look at this beauty. All right, let's dig in. So I'm gonna go ahead with this light pink shade and I'm gonna cover my whole eyelid with that. It's called Pinkity Drinkity. Okay, so Pinkity Drinkity, she's made an appearance. She's there, but she's a little shy. Okay, now that Pinkity Drinkity has made her appearance, moving on to the next cola. All right, we're gonna intensify things and go ahead and add in some skip. She is beautiful. Ooh. Okay, hi. Wow, she is pink. Oh my God, this is so cute. I'm totally getting Barbie vibes. I know this looks crazy right now, but mm, let's just hope it gets better. Trust the process. So that is really this Pink right here is really the star of the show. She is the main color, but we are gonna add some more colors to it. So I'm gonna go ahead with these two purples right here. Yeah, I'm gonna start off with single and then I'm gonna move on to love that. I'm gonna apply single to the corners of the eyes. Okay guys, I know this looks really crazy right now, but um, let's just keep working this out and see how it comes along. So I'm gonna go back with the Jeffree Star palette and go in for bubblegum. And I'm gonna apply that underneath that pink wing right there. And I, oh, and I, oh, and I, oh. Okay. So everything that I did on this side, I'm gonna do it on this side. By the way, guys, I did add some gumdrop from the Jeffree Star palette on top of the single and love it colors but then i go back to skip and put that on top of what i got right here all right guys as you can see there's a lot going on here a whole bunch of purples and pinks and it looks crazy but now i'm going to go in with my concealer and carve everything out i'm going to make it look more like a wing and i'm also going to draw a line through the eyeshadow You'll see. So as you guys can see, I'm slowly carving out and make more of a wing shape. Okay guys, I'm not kidding you. This was the hardest thing to do by far in my entire life. It literally took me like three hours. After I carved out the wing shape with the concealer, I added the NYX liquid white eyeliner right here to make that line. Now I'm gonna add a little oomph to the bottom of the eye because it's looking really, really lonely down there. So I'm gonna go in with some more Skip and just apply it to the bottom of the eye. I'm gonna go in with the Jeffree Star palette and put some snack on the corners of the eyelid. I'm also gonna add that to my eyebrow bone. Oh my God, yes. Okay, so now I'm gonna add a really thin layer of black liquid eyeliner on my eye. Okay, we've had some technical difficulties. Turns out my eyeliner decided to dry out on me, so we're not using her anymore. So I'm gonna go in with one of my go-to contour shades. It's from the Balm. Take home the bronze in the shade gray. All right, boo-boo. Face is snatched, honey. Now I'm gonna add some blush and some highlighter. I'm going in for the Tarte in shade Quirky. To give me a nice little rosy finish. Okay, time for some highlighter. Okay, now I'm gonna add some lip liner and then some lipstick. 
So I'm gonna go in for this ColourPop in the shade Finders Keepers, Losers Weepers. It's like a purplish, pinkish mauve. All right, guys, we just need the lashes and we're done. So I'm gonna be using the Mink Lashes from Broadway in the style Bell. All right, guys, lashes are on. After applying the lashes, I went ahead and added some cute little ribbons on the side of my eyes. Okay, now I'm gonna add the wig and the outfit and we're done. I'll be right back. All right, guys, I am pinked out. Got my ribbons right there, you know, gotta represent. Oh my God, look at my hands. <gasps> my breast cancer awareness look i hope you guys enjoyed this video this is a special tribute to all the very courageous and brave women who have been diagnosed with breast cancer who have fought their battle and those who have passed on to all the family and anyone who has been affected by breast cancer i love you guys so much now before we finish you know i gotta shout out my joker gang so here we go shout out Shout out, shout out to Unicorn Panda, Maria, Jack, Leslie, Juliet, Ryan, and Aya. Shout out to all my jokers. I love you guys so much. And if you're not a joker yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. And when you subscribe, make sure to hit that notification bell and set it to all. That way you guys don't miss any videos at all. I love you guys so much. I gotta go wash this off. I am turning pink. Love you.